chocks and chocolates and in between chocolate birds here for another video review it's the galaxy cookies double chocolate chunk wow look at those they do look very nice don't they? they do look very nice but these um cookies from experience sometimes not these necessarily these galaxy ones but these sort of products in this tray you know the mars type cookies or whatever can be a bit disappointing they tend to just you know they, they, they lack the finesse or the association really as far as delivery is concerned with the product that they're based on I say or whatever or the brand like galaxy in this case well this taste of galaxy I mean, you do get galaxy white chocolate in some instances, but not really. So, you know, what's it going to be like? Is it just going to be basically a double chocolate chip cookie? And although those are quite nice, is it going to miss the point? So we'll see. We'll see. But nonetheless, it looks pretty good from a, <laughs> from a first impression point of view, that's for sure. All right, so we've got a really nice design. Nothing too dramatic going on, really, other than the fact that um, it's got the ingredients list and stuff like that on the side. What does it say? Crisp cookies containing milk and white chocolate chunks. Okay, there's the ingredients. So we've got... Uh, Milk chocolate chunks, 18%. What's the white chocolate? White chocolate chunks, 10%. So only 10%. Look at that. So it's almost half as much white chocolate as milk chocolate. Now, why is that? You know, why is that? So, yeah. So that means 30, was it? 72% of it is biscuit after that. So, you know. Mm, so we'll see. Are any uh, palm oil things? There's palm oil. There you go. The palm oil's in there as well. No, that's right. <laughs> Anything else of interest? Yeah, not seeing anything, palm fat, but I guess palm oil, palm fat, I guess it's much of a muchness. So Porsche's per pack nine. So I just reviewed some Twix ones and they had uh, only eight in there. Portion size 18 grams. So yeah, even though the portion size was the same, they had eight biscuits in the Twix one and the uh, eight cookies. And they've got nine in this one, so that's weird, isn't it? So per 100 grams, 520 calories, 20 grams of fat, 16 of which are saturates. And per cookie, 18 grams, 95 calories, 5.1 grams of fat, 2.8 of which are saturates. Yeah, so I mean, if you look... You know, here's the Twix ones, you know, portion size 18 grams, 96 calories per cookie, portions per pack 8, portions per pack 9, 18 grams, 95 calories per cookie. So, you know, yeah, bizarre, isn't it, that? Why is that? 162 grams for the pack, 144, so a bit of a joke, that, but they are, you know, they, I mean, obviously I've opened this one, but they were the same size. So a bit of a joke, that, a bit of a joke. Right, okay, so what else have we got to say? Well, nice, nice purple design there, I like that. I don't know what the purple's for, really. It doesn't, uh, you know, is that for the white chocolate? I think, uh, sort of like the branding, I don't know, but I like it. Purple's my favourite colour, so I like that addition. Yeah, it looks very nice, really. We'll continue all the way around in some instances, but overall not too, too bad. I guess it does on this side, I think it's just not on this bit, which I guess is so you can see the uh, nutrition information. So we've got other stuff. It's made by Burton's Biscuits. Yeah, you recycle with uh, bags at large supermarkets to recycle at home. Tray you can recycle. So yeah, interesting. I don't, I don't, you know, let me know what you think of this one about this recycle at large supermarkets. Do you do that? Maybe people do and I'm just not aware of it. But yeah, but nonetheless, it does have the big green dot that says this company does support recycling, but you can't necessarily recycle this product. Throw it in the bin, it says. And that's kind of contradicting this, isn't it? So it's a bit of a confusing one, but there we go. All right, well, I think we need to just give them an open so they look like on the inside. So let's do it. Let's give them an open. Okay, then I'm going to give these Galaxy Cookies double chocolate chunk an open. So, yeah, we just need to get into it. So let's do it. The time code have done about 1,050 reviews or something like that anyway. So if you like this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and so on. In the top right corner, I've got links to place of all those other reviews. There's also some related ones, which are the Galaxy ones, or the biscuit ones, or the cookie ones. <laughs> There are even other white chocolate ones, who knows? So yeah, after you watch some uh, like subscribe, go check those out. If you enjoyed us too. Alright, so there we go. So yeah, interesting this one. So basically, the uh, here's the example of the Twix one I had before, and it had like this partition in the middle. Whereas this one doesn't have the partition, it's fitting an extra cookie. You know, so I mean I've had one of these, but there was only eight in there. Bit of a joke, really. Bit of a joke that. Alright, okay. Let's have a look at these then. So they look very nice, very chock full of stuff, you would definitely say. Interesting. Mm, all right, let's give a bit of a measure then. I'm expecting them to be quite similar to the Twix ones I've done. That's 6.25 there. And it's a very knobbly cookie, 5.5 there, roughly. You know, they're not straight at all, about six centimeters there. Height, roughly, again, a bit knobbly, about 1.5, but again, two centimeters there. So it can depend. <laughs> so the, uh, yeah, but it's not worth making too much of a note of that all right there we go so you can see it's not much of a white chocolate uh, on display definitely more milk chocolate and that was reflected by the fact that it's only 10 percent white chocolate is it's 18 percent milk chocolate it's hard to see the white chocolate as well of course that's a chunk there though 
to score a bit of it all, just looks a bit like the cookie almost. Mm. But yeah, you can't see much, uh, we'll see white chocolate around it, but it's definitely there. Just can't see as much, and there's just naturally not as much anyway, which is a shame. I say naturally, that's uh, purposely made so there's not as much, or you know, what have you. <laughs> but alright, let's find out what they taste like. So let's lift ourselves up, give them a taste. Okay, everyone, gonna give these, uh, yes, Galaxy Cookies double chocolate chunk a taste. Very excited for these ones, very excited indeed. So, um, yeah, got one that we snapped in half earlier, so let's just give it a taste. Let's do it. Mm. Not bad, but quite a generic cookie. Just had the Twix ones before these, and um, it's quite similar to that, to be honest with you. It's got a bit of a, you know, white chocolate taste in there. But um, other than that, it's not too dissimilar. I think the Twix one had these like, like caramel pieces in there, very, you know, a limited amount of them. It kind of gave it a bit, very odd texture. And this one doesn't have that, it just has chocolate chunks. Um, mm, give a bit of a dip in this. Uh, Hot drink I've got here, so let's see. Most uh, biscuits cookies always taste better when dunked. Mm. Mm. Does soften the biscuits up a bit, maybe I need to dunk it a bit longer, but I was a bit worried it would uh, <laughs> collapse. Um, mm. It could um, sustain a bit more of a dunkage, but yeah. Not bad, but it's not anything great. It tastes like quite a sort of typical chocolate chip cookie. The white chocolate's there, you can taste it a bit, but I wish there was more of it, for sure. You know, it is the bit that gives you the bit of a diverse flavour of it, makes it stand out a bit more, it's just something different than a chocolate chip cookie. Um, we just don't get as many chunks of those, unfortunately. So, it doesn't have any semblance, really, with Galaxy whatsoever. I won't say the chocolate chips taste like Galaxy. I don't think they are Galaxy chocolate at all. So it doesn't give you that smooth, lovely, creamy... Beautiful Galaxy chocolate taste, it just tastes like regular chocolate chunks, you know. And obviously, the white chocolate's nothing to do with Galaxy, it's basically just a biscuit made by Burton's and they've just branded it as Galaxy, you know what I mean? That's all it is, really. So, and you can tell that it's um, it's all right, but it could almost be anything. It doesn't, it tastes quite similar to sort of like supermarket own brand, you know, triple or double chocolate chip cookies, that kind of thing. You know, I wouldn't say it's any better, no, so it's okay. Um, but it's just overall quite disappointing really but still nice having said all that because obviously it is a biscuit with chocolate chips in there's quite a lot of chocolate chips it's quite chunky you know um as you can see they're mainly just milk chocolate ones there's very few I mean, you see some white chocolate ones going on here and things yes yeah, so it's not too too bad but they don't stand out as much of course but it is mainly milk chocolate so that is a bit of an issue unfortunately it's a shame but a galaxy is really milk chocolate though, having said all that but nonetheless I feel like the white chocolate is what makes it stand out as being a bit more interesting. And because it's not actually galaxy chocolate, you know, <laughs> um, at least you can discern anyway. It's uh, a bit just generally disappointing. I mean, we'll just try one of the, I mean, you know, can I try a chunk on its own? As I say, I'm quite sure these are not galaxy chocolate chunks. I didn't feel like them. They're just, yeah, they're the same chocolate they use in the Twix biscuits, basically. Those little chocolate drops. Hmm, yeah. And it's not galaxy chocolate at all. <laughs> um, yeah, got some chocolate chunks in this one, but in the tw Twix one it calls them chocolate uh, drops, so but they are seemingly the same thing. At least this one, that one anyway. So yeah, so for me these ones, the regular digestive biscuits are 2 out of 5, milk chocolate digestives are 3 out of 5. I mean these are kind of on a par with that, more or less. You know, I think they're just disappointed by the fact that they're not really galaxy, and there's not as much white chocolate in. But, uh, you know, I don't know. I don't know, it's not quite as disappointing as a Twix one, which just was nothing really like Twix at all, and I was missing out on a few things that could have made it more Twix-like. But then again, you know, this one's basically just a double chocolate chip cookie, and it's not that much, you know, that's what you'd probably expect from it. It's just branded as Galaxy. It is a bit disappointing as a result of that. I did mark the Twix one down as being disappointing. This one's not quite as disappointing, because I think the Twix one, you know, had more to, more to offer to make it taste like a Twix, and it just didn't offer that. But again, this one, you'd expect at least Galaxy chocolate in, wouldn't you? I think that's the one thing with Galaxy you would expect. I mean, Mars and Twix and things are not really known for having a chocolate-specific taste, whereas Galaxy is. So I think I'm going to have to mark it down again for this by half a mark. So I think otherwise it would have been a three, but I'm going to give it a two and a half out of five. All right, guys, let me know what you think of this one. Yeah, leave a comment for free. Always great to hear from me. Always doing best to reply. Check out the videos that's on the screen now. Great support my channel where I continue to watch my content. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Check out the links for the Discord server and the member program. Links are in the description for those. And have a great day, and I'll see you next time. Thanks again, guys. Take care. Bye for now. See ya.